Hey guys, welcome to Let's Play Chrono Cross. Last time we did some more endings. This is going to be my intro for a while now. This time we're doing more endings, but first I want to show off something rather interesting. And while I was getting up here to do this, I realized something else. You may realize from where I am at the moment that we're about to head into Fort Dragonia and become Lynx. We have taken care of all of the endings before coming becoming Lynx. So before I go to do that, there's one variation on a scene that we can see that you can only manage with either Game Shark hacks or a new, in a new game plus. And that's to show how Surge as Lynx deals with our own party. While I was over here checking things out, I noticed something. There's not one point in the entirety of the game where I had this many status healing items. And if you look here, I have five sea swallows. Anything that is in the file that you continue plus on when you uh, make your final save file will be added. So I've got multiple sea swallows. I've got multiple extra various crap. I don't have any additional power seals or sunglasses or spectra swallows because I didn't have those at this point in the game. But when I continue plus onto later files, I will have access to those items. And presumably I should be able to duplicate those and a number of powerful elements as well. You'll never be able to duplicate any of the uh, summon elements. And now that the glitch is gone, you won't be able to duplicate, I don't think I have any yet, any of the level seven elements either, the uh, level seven tech elements. So anyway, I just figured I'd mention that there is a way of duplicating things in the game and it doesn't take all that long as you've seen by the amount of time it takes me to, to finish off the, uh, the final boss there. So what I'm gonna do here is I'm gonna go through the process of all these cutscenes and then I will show you the fight when we become Lynx against our party. Because things are a little different now. Okay, we're back, and this is the first half of the fight when we are still ourselves. And I want to show aspects of this fight to show you that, yeah, we completely outpower anything, any enemies that we could possibly face at this point. If we do boatloads of damage, the enemies cannot hold on to us at all. But they seem to have a little more HP. I'm not sure if this is 100% true, but they seem to have a little more HP. I remember the enemies around here having about 1,000. I did close to 2,000 at the time. Also note that you do gain levels. There's a plane going by. Hopefully you can't hear that. Uh, there are additional levels that you can gain. You get additional star levels. You get additional stats. Everything's going to end up around the same. I think the maximum HP for Surge is like 850 or something like that. I have vague memories of that from my uh, initial playthrough. I doubt that memory card still holds any data. It's probably all dead now. I'm sure the batteries died on it. Yeah, you can continue to gain stat ups and you can fight in between to try and get uh, the mini stat ups, but you can only get so far and so many stats. The higher your levels go, the less you'll get uh, the stats uh, over the, the course of the game. So yeah, as I've talked about, this is Surge's past. This is the event uh, 14 years ago. Surge is having a little flashback. And this is when he was attacked by a panther demon and poisoned and then taken to uh, Chronopolis. And then uh, 10 years ago is when Lynx came back and attacked him on the beach again. Uh, and this time, uh, well, not again, I guess he came and attacked him to finish the uh, job. And in another world, he was successful in a home world. Kid came through time splitting the. Uh, splitting the events and save them.
it's even weirder to have the uh, body switch take place knowing what we know about what Lynx is, you know, the familial con connection, the fact that it's been dis like a distorted version of his father, yet also the living interface of a biological and mechanical supercomputer. It's weird. But it doesn't change the fact that no matter how many times I see it, that's fucking awesome. All right, now, one of the things I wanted to do was open up my menu, and I'm trying to open the menu, and it's not working. Can't open the menu to see what uh, happens here. But your equipment uh, carries over from Surge to Lynx right away somehow. And so we have a Spectra Swallow, some sunglasses, a couple of power seals. This fight is now doable. Now, technically, you can see the, uh, the shiny effect there on the, uh, whatever it is there, the, uh, the glide hook, the scythe. The only time you get to see Surge and Lynx's body using a scythe And, as you can see, our party still does a decent amount of damage to us. They're based off of our stats. Of course, not HP-wise. And, like, they're not, like, overpowered or anything like that. Let's, uh... Keep an eye on how many healing techs that I have here. There's Dash and Slash. There's Feral Cats. Okay, I'm going to go for the Cure Plus here. Like, it's not a guaranteed fight by any stretch of the imagination. And you're going to want uh, Prism Equipment to uh, survive this. You may even want to uh, set up a number of buffs. Holy crap, can you please not? Alright, so there's Forever Zero. Do I have any better healing setups? I probably should have put other elements on. Interesting thought just occurred to me. I wonder what happens if I would have put Holy Healing on uh, Lynx here. Yeah, that doesn't do a whole lot of damage, which is nice. Really wish I had more stamina. I don't know if I'm going to be able to actually win this fight. I was expecting this to go a lot easier. I probably should have put some elements on. And I probably can't do that anymore. Okay, there we go. He, does, he wasn't sagging, so I was trying to figure out, okay, am, am I able to actually do this? Uh, Gwen is more of a threat here. All right, what else we got here? Recover all, recover all. Yeah, Surge is obviously the biggest threat want to get rid of him first. Ah, come on, game! <laughs> Give me a break here! Just when I think that I have a chance. <laughs> I don't know if I'm going to be able to make this work. <laughs> I did not expect to struggle this much. Part of it is the fact that I'm not getting any stamina back. 
and I don't really know why. Like, I should be getting a lot more stamina back than I am. And it's just not happening. Okay, well, I'm gonna die anyway. Interesting. I did not remember it being that difficult to do that fight, which really sucks. Now I'm gonna have to reload and do that all over again. Wow. It's not anywhere near that difficult in the uh, original version of the game. You slaughter them in seconds. Like, it's, it's kind of sad. Anyway, I will reload and try again. <laughs> Round two. And as I went back, I have a feeling equipping them with all the prism gear might have made things worse. We'll see. This time, I didn't equip anyone other than Surge. Let's see if that affects. It does affect their damage. Yay, not giving them uh, Prism equipment is probably for the best. We'll still get a lot of damage. Uh, so it, Holy Healing does work. <laughs> cool. It's the only time you change uh, innate colors. Uh, like, in a way that you wouldn't be able to have that all set up. So, anyway, that's cool. There we go. Not quite dead yet. So, he'll still... He'll do damage, not as much. I also put the uh, Prism Hat, or Prism Helm on as well to make life a little easier. Now I know why I was taking so much damage. <laughs> I was making this fight far more difficult than it needed to be. Would you please hit something? Having the uh, field effect all uh, black was helping out my damage, which is nice. And there, down goes Surge. So yeah, it's a lot easier than I was making it out to be. And use free fall it'll help me a little more but yeah ultra nova on a character who uh is not that right in normally only monsters get to do that but we get to do it as well not that i think using that is probably worth it but actually i'll probably build up to uh forever zero here so what you'll want to do there is defend so that you take reduced damage if you're still worried about uh the damage that you're taking there. I love interrupting you. You may want to uh, put on Eagle Eye for this fight. That's up to you. I had put Infernos there in case I needed to lower their attack power by you put, uh, inflicting them with burns. I went all out in preparation for this, and then as I was doing that, I was like, oh yeah, equipment. I should probably leave them without the powerful equipment. Eagle Eye it is. <laughs> so I don't miss anymore. There we go. Now, as I showed before in the Lavas fight, when you're by yourself, the amount of uh, time that your uh, Eagle Eye seems to last seems to be longer. I'm not worried about taking less damage because kid can't really hurt me but yeah it seems to last longer this way anyway when you finish it Serge looks at his hands and wonders what he did and with a last ditch effort kid stabs links i.e. Surge, and the scene plays out exactly as it would have. But it's nice that they threw an extra little bit of scene in there to show off different variations on that. You definitely showed him.
nothing else changes uh, for the rest of the scene. So what I'm going to do is I'm going to go and continue plus on the file uh, for the ending for today, and we will get to that. For this ending to occur, you need to do it after you become Lynx, but before saving Riddell at Viper Manor. In this case, apparently we're living in Marbul. I guess the uh, the rest of the world didn't really enjoy demi-humans, and we were all demi-humans at this point. I just used a file of basically as soon as we got out, before we even got Radius. Uh, if you're looking for a good uh, doppelgang for Sprig in order to get through that process, uh, turn into White Knight. White Knight's already got high physical strength, so it'll do well after the element setup. And within White Knight's element grid, you have black, yellow, and red elements. So you can do that and it'll it'll work out relatively well for you. Uh, also, the, the fight with the time devourer is a little bit easier at this point uh, because we have Lynx as our main damage dealer now and Lynx is black innate. And the uh, even though it's a merger of Lavos and Scala and the dragon gods, the time devourer is white innate. So we just do a little bit extra damage, speeds things along a little bit. And apparently we're living with Harley at this point. Hey, look who's in the pool there. That's Irene's. Wonder if we actually get to talk to her or not. I don't recall. For a new Marvel. Wasn't this night? Lynxy, oh god. Oh, it's a kid, okay. Lynx is very busy. <laughs> well, at least it's nice to have a relatively happy ending. I guess we're not going to talk to Irene's. Oh well. Apparently we're just going to help out the people that are here. It seems relatively peaceful. Oh, there we go. Siren of the Sea. About that person you were looking for. Leave it to us. I would suspect Marcy. But that's just a guess. I don't know who else you would be. Or no, the sage. You're looking for the sage. That's right. Oh, never mind. There's the sage. Um, not sure who you were looking for then. Nikki? Marcy? I would guess one of the two. So this would be Homeworld when we first got there. We didn't even have a boat at this point, nor did we do anything to save uh, Marbul at this point. So I'm not really sure I understand the reasoning for this ending being here. Several months, maybe. Well, no, because we weren't allowed to change over to the other dimension. This wouldn't be another world because they're rebuilding it. Yeah, I'm not exactly sure what's going on here. What else do you have uh, for us to do here? Oh? Everybody is generating a positive attitude. Golden opportunity to bring about a change to our dated way of thinking. Have to associate with human folk on equal terms. Hmm. You're too old for this. Once you become the leader of Marbule, the way demi-humans view the world will change for the better. Remember, Surge is still in that body. He would have a 
presumably higher opinion of humans than most typical demi -humans. So do we want to? Um, from what I gather, I was uh, poking around. There, apparently if you change the order of the party so that Surge isn't in the lead or Lynx isn't in the lead. Sometimes this ending and maybe some of the other ones too get mixed up and like you'll have Sprig here, you know, like Harley will be addressing Sprig and they'll show the Sprig sprite on the screen instead. Like if you happen to have Sprig as the lead of your party. I saw some YouTube clips on that, um, so you could play around with that if you're interested in laughing at this ending, but uh, I think with a lot of the other endings, it has to be those specific characters and well, it's possible they could screw those ones up too. Hmm, interesting thought. I don't know. You don't have to answer right away. Everybody looks up to you, even though you never say anything. <laughs> Sad music. Still looking for a way to get your old self back. Though that would probably impact what the demi-humans are trying to do. Hmm. Well, I guess we can help them for now. Because you'll still be looking for a way to find your own body in the meantime. Aww, isn't that sweet? Looking to you for guidance. Of course, when you don't speak, not a lot of guidance you can offer. Yes, you can, you know, set examples, you know, by your actions, but still. Well, isn't that nice? Ah, the uh, Geriatric Dragoons. The uh, remaining members of the Old Dragoons. They're the ones to confront Surge, Evil Surge. The three old farts. I suppose I'll hear what you have to say. Countless evil deeds you have committed cannot go unpunished. Prepare yourself. Yep. Avenge my son. I too am a villain. Just my reasons are just. <laughs> Nothing but a disgrace to all villainy. Well, that's... I guess it shouldn't be a surprise, but... Uh, she's still being mind controlled at this point. Ain't gonna let you get away a Surge's plan. I do need to get used to my new body. Take you on all as well. Would have been an interesting uh, fight. And another ending in the books. Remember, after each one, we want to save over that same file, we'll continue to duplicate all of our stuff and we're going to use that file going forward to load up more saves and keep going over and over and over again until we finish off all the remaining endings and then there'll be some other stuff to do and an extra new game plus only bonus boss and getting some more level seven text that i wasn't able to show off because i didn't have the characters getting all the characters in one file Still a lot left to do. Anyway, that's pretty much all for this one. And I'll see you guys next time.